Hey guys, um, this isn't like a, it's a video, but it's not anything like special. I just kind of, I wanted to share with you, um, I guess it's kind of like a, a thrift haul. It's a handy down. Um, my sister, um, has a son that's a year or so older than my little boy. And the reason I'm sharing this is because, um, I just wanted to, say like don't be afraid to say yes to handy downs or don't be too snobby to accept handy downs because you never know what you'll get um like the things that my sister buys for her kids it's not the same style that I would buy for my own but I do always find a few pieces within the handy down bag <laughs> see it's just in a trash bag nothing special but I do find a few things in there that either my son can grow into, which I store in a tote in his extra closet, or things that he can play in. And there might be a few really good pieces that um, I still might not be my taste and what I would pick out for him, but are still very good things. So I just thought I would share with you guys what's in the handy down bag. I love handy downs. There's nothing better than free stuff. Um, so there's this little jacket and he can actually wear this now and a hood I'm just gonna pile it up cuz I'm gonna wash it anyway and see like this is not stuff I would typically typically buy for my son but a little flannel shirt um, and I meant no disrespect towards like my sister or anything or her taste of clothing um, I she's always into like button-up stuff for her son and I'm not Here's the little t-shirt. He can always play in that. This is, this is cute. Um, you know. But I'm always, always up for handy downs. Here's the, some little shorts and the shirt to match it. Like, this is cute. I would put this on my son for sure. And, let's see. Um, a little, a little sweatshirt. Handy downs are even better than thrifting or Goodwill because they're completely free most of the time. And a little vest that he can wear with a white shirt under it for church. So that's a really good one. It's not a piece, like, it's not a piece that he would wear every day, but for, like, church or, you know, something that he needs to, you know, dress up a little bit, I can always add to that vest, sweater vest, whatever that thing is and dress it up a bunch more. See, like, I'm not typically into button-ups. And then this makes a great play shirt, and he loves cars. Here's another sweatshirt. Can you guys see that? Oh, and I hope this is alright, you guys. I'm just chill. I'm in my jammies. Um, I'm getting ready to take my makeup off and go to bed, but I wanted to share you know never be too good for handy downs because you never know what you're going to get and another button down <laughs> or button up button down whatever it's called and then here are some jammies and these are some fleece jammies so these will be good for winter time when it starts to get cold another jammy set and this is what the shirt looks like. Kind of. So, I mean, I'm always up for jammies that, you know, are in good shape for my kids. Another play shirt. And then another sweatshirt. And this would be something that I would buy for my son. I think this is cute. World's best brother. So adorable. Another play shirt in my eyes um a kid stain stuff like my son another hood my son i can go buy him brand new clothes and i promise you um he'll wear that outfit one time and it will be completely stained after that see this is something like i would buy for my son i like this type of sweatshirt oh i forgot this shirt i think this has some shorts with it or something i'm not real for sure Maybe not. And then I don't typically, my son does have a pair of boots. I want to say, I don't, they're like, they look like Timberlands, but they're not. It's like a baby brand boot. 
Um, my son won't fit in these. These are John Deere. Um, I'll store these back in a tote or I put like the clothing that is too big for my son I will put in like one of those bags that you can suck all the air out that way you know it's like this thick and I can shove it in the spare closet but look I mean these boots are very nice they're a little scuffed up but I mean he'd be riding four wheelers or something in them anyway these sandals are not typically like anything that I would buy my son but they're free so you know and these tennis shoes are not anything that I would typically buy for my son, but I can put them up. They need cleaned up a little bit, but I can put like these shoes and some of these clothes. Um, I can clean them up and put them up. And if my nieces or my nephews are here and they don't have spare clothes, I can dig in this stuff and find them something. So even if I don't use it for my son, I can always use it for my nieces and nephews that are here and you know spur of the moment kind of stay the night and they don't have you know clothes or whatever but yeah I just thought I would share with you that somebody offers you something don't be afraid to accept handy downs don't be afraid to say yeah man I'd like to have that um, and don't be too good to accept handy downs either I love handy downs like pass them my way please and um and another thing like when i donate i try to donate to places that i don't shop at like we have this one store i can't remember what it's called exactly it's kind of like it's family owned like it's my daughter's dad's side of the family that owns it we call it the quarter store almost everything in there is a quarter except for like bigger furniture pieces and then still they're you know less than 30 bucks so like we don't shop there but whenever I donate my my items that I have, I take to there, and then everything's a quarter, and it's super cheap. People that don't have the extra money just to go blow on whatever at Goodwill or the thrift stores, they can go to that store and get very nice pieces for you know a quarter or you know very small amounts of money. Because Goodwill, like it kind of gets expensive after a while. Um, thrifting, depending on what you're looking for, if it's anything like antique-ish or anything that's popular on YouTube, it's this uh, the price is skyrocket. So you know what I mean. So I always like to donate to a place that I know the prices are super cheap and places that don't normally get like good quality stuff. I like to donate there. That way, people that don't have money can go to there and get it for a super cheap price and it's nice things. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the handy down thing. I'm getting ready to go to bed and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.